At Chaminade College Preparatory High School, the Eagle Regiment is represented by four collaborative and equally important groups. The Horn Line, The Drum Line, The Pit, The Color Guard. These are their stories. What do you like about band? <laughs> I like band because music, I think, is a really universal language. So no matter like what like walk of life you come from or whatever, you know, activities at school you're involved in, I think everyone can kind of relate to the band because they all understand like the joy of playing music and they all kind of can tie themselves together through music. I like that band is more of like a family instead of just a club that you go to once a month. Um, you gain a lot of really close connections with people that last nearly a lifetime and you can just be yourself and no one really judges you for it. It's a ton of fun. You get together, you make really fun music and have an overall good time. It's really rewarding. Uh, I like the fact that, you know, everyone kind of knows each other since it's a smaller group, but also the fact that I get to play my instrument. And the fact that I kind of prefer Eagle Regiment is because we get to play for all the fans of not only the football team, but kind of of us, too. We can talk to them about things. We're not just a group of friends. We're more like a family. We're really close together as a whole unit. To have all these experiences with them, and since we're the leaders of the band, we're the seniors, we're the leadership, we get to guide the band in the direction that we want to do. Like, I would never have gone, like, in a parade or like being able to go like to a competition and witness all these cool bands performing and stuff. I would have never been able to experience that. When I first came to the school, I didn't know anyone, so band was a time for me to get new friends and to make new relationships that I still have today. It's also a great way to build respect and to build um, new friendships and new relationships and to even learn a new skill, which is really important in life. What instrument do you play and what else would you want to play and why? Right now, I play snare drum. I'm in the drum line, and I am the center snare. If I had to play a different instrument, I would probably choose baritone because it's one of the bottom few on the bottom of the musical pyramid. Uh, I play the trumpet right now, uh, and an instrument that I would like to play would be like the tuba because really, like, all the time we hear that the tuba is supposed to be the loudest, so that's one of the reasons why I would love to play it. I play euphonium. Um... Some other instruments I play is uh, basically most of the brass. I can play tuba, baritone, it's like the euphonium, uh, trombone, kind of trumpet, uh, maybe higher brass like French horns and stuff. I play the uh, alto saxophone and the uh, timpanis for our show. And uh, if I had to play a different instrument, it'd probably be auxiliary percussion or any other type of percussive instrument because I really like the rhythm, rhythmic aspect of those instruments and they're just... It's really cool how to get those sounds out of them. Well, right now I'm in color guard, but my first two years I marched flute for my freshman and sophomore year. How has music impacted your life? I think music has taught me a lot of things about, you know, how to like manage my time and how to like work harder than I normally would have. Um, I started playing guitar in fifth grade, and then I got to high school and I started uh, in the marching band my sophomore year. And before that, like my freshman year, I was really like, unmotivated and I just kind of like went through my classes, went through the routine, but I wasn't actually like trying my best at anything. And then by joining Marching Man, by really challenging myself through like harder and harder music, I was able to push myself and I learned how to manage my time and how to balance out all the things in my life that include music so that I could you know, become a better, more well-rounded person. Music is a stress reliever. It helps me focus. It helps me not deal with all my issues. And when I play music, I forget everything bad that's that's going on in my life and it's just like a very huge and integral part of my life um personally my life kind of revolves around music uh whenever i'm feeling super happy or super sad music tends to go along with that and so um 
I would say that's very important to me. Well, the fact that I've been able to listen to so much music from artists or orchestras, it's sort of cool how you can understand lyrics or just be put in a different mindset because of just a certain song that you listen to. Well, I think music, playing music specifically, allows me to get a lot of my feelings out. Like, I'm angry, I just play my instrument a lot and I can express that in a way, like, I can make my instrument sound angry and I can express my anger through that. Or if I just, like, want to mess around, I can just mess around with my instrument. Music's always been a big part of my life because ever since I was little, like five, I've been learning to play music, whether it's been the piano, producing music electronically, or vocalists, or playing saxophone. That's always been something I've been, I've been interested in. Uh, always learning different instruments. Whenever I'm into something new, music plays a big part of it. And I'm always, my musical tastes are always changing, and it's something that I really want to do as a, for a career, and it's something that I'm going to keep with me for the rest of my life, whether I pursue it or not. My daily experience is like, without music, I would not be where I am today. I would not be in band. I would not be able to play any instruments. Without music, I feel like my life would be a little bit boring. Do you have to be a good musician to be in band? Not at all. <laughs> Let me tell you. All right, when I first joined band, it was my sophomore year. And I knew like nothing, like, compared to everyone else, I actually joined like the last day of band camp, so everyone else was way ahead of me, and I got here and I knew nothing at all. And so I was kind of thrown into the mix, not knowing much, and then throughout the year, you know, people understood that I didn't know much, so they walked me through the basics, and then by the end of the year, I was, I was ready to move up to the next instrument, so my junior year got moved to a harder instrument, and um, you know, it's a process for sure, like, I, wasn't, I was never like great at it, but this year I think, um, just by continually practicing and rehearsing with the band and pushing myself to be better, I've definitely become good enough where, you know, I'm teaching the younger guys now who aren't necessarily experienced. So, you know, it's a process. We all help each other through it. So it's all good no matter what level you're at. I have one statement. Look at me. <laughs> that answers the question. No, you don't have to be a good musician to be in band. Um, it's pretty... I would say that it's difficult at the beginning to get into it. Um, but once you kind of get the hang of things, like I really had never read music my freshman year, and then all of a sudden learned how to play drums and um, kind of just evolved from there. I feel the only qualification that you must have is your determination and your passion to get better, because people aren't going to be amazing at band when they first try. I was awful, but my drive and my passion and my determination brought me to where I am today. Before you joined band, what did you think it was all about, and how does your view of band differ now that you are a member? Well, as I was coming to band as a freshman, I thought marching band would just be like, oh, here's our instrument, we're running around the field, and it wouldn't be anything like... I knew it would be organized, but I didn't understand the dedication and hard work, hard work you had to put in. And now that I am a member, I respect other people for the hard work and dedication they put into their passions and things they enjoy. and. I want to do that. For, I want to put even more hard work and dedication into the things that I do. I made the mistake of wearing a full suit, a uh, button down shirt, and a tie and slacks to the first practice. And I was in the complete wrong dress. Uh, we ran laps, we did suicides across the field, and I had to do it in my, uh, in my suit. I thought it was like a group of people who were like super talented, and like there was no way I could possibly be as good at playing an instrument as they were. But like now that I'm in band and been playing for a while, I realize that it's, it's not that scary as you think it is, that people will help you get to their level. When I first joined band, I thought it was just a whole bunch of looking cool and knowing all of your parts and keeping yourself and just making sure you get everything you do right to the inch, which really was a big turnoff for me, which was in my, kind of my fault. But now that I've uh, been here for a while, I see that it's a lot different than that. It's not just working on yourself, it's working and working on your parts as a team and working to blend in and co coalesce with everybody else in band, plus looking cool. I realize that there's a lot more commitment and effort that we need to put in as a whole group because you're, when you work, you're also doing this for a bunch of other kids too. So we're working as one giant community to make something great.